Hey everybody, I'm Accidental Grenade and welcome back to Binding of Isaac Rebirth. We're sitting on a dozen wins. Let's make it a baker's dozen, shall we? We're it's time for we did a blue baby run last time, so we've got Isaac, Eden, and Eve coming up. So Isaac first here, continuing through our rotation. So <clears throat> on the Isaac runs, let's take a look at our seed here for Z M S D Z R one one. Couple of Z's, nice. We'll go in here right away. On the Isaac runs, and happy to be Isaac and have a bomb here. Very nice payout, and again, extremely nice there. I think I will actually keep the health, and I'm going to reroll this immediately into ceremonial robes and feel very good about our situation. Um, so this is what I was just about to say on the Isaac runs. They're, <laughs> they're a little more comfortable. Um, you're a little less likely to lose, so I'll be looking to uh, accomplish other things when I can, yeah. Oh my god, okay. Let's lock it up. First Isaac run of the day, always a little rusty. Already lost two black hearts. Um, unicorn stump can be amazing, but we're not going to take it right now at least. Um, but what other things would I like to accomplish, you know, during my Isaac run here? Well, I'd like to uh, donate to the donation machine as much as I can. I'd like to try to check all the secret rooms um, to get those items. I'd like to maybe aim for angel rooms because I believe I still have yet to pick up the godhead. And it's one of the only items I need in addition to the secret rooms and, uh, you know, a full-size uh, bandage girl, etc., etc. I will go over here. I do want to check where the secret room is, but there are a couple locations we have no bombs, so that's a thing. Um, whatever this guy gives, we're probably not going to be able to get it because it's going to be in there. Yep. Yep, that's annoying. Faux show, but it's okay. It wasn't bombs, um, but it could have, there could have been a bomb in that chest. We'll never know. Let's, uh, let's fight the boss. If we get a bomb here, we could make use of it to get in there, but we can't really count on that. There's only a couple of items that give bombs. Uh, what do you got? You got matchbook, um, the box... Uh, what else? Um, I mean, is there something else that gives bombs that I'm not thinking of? I don't think so, but I could be missing another one. Mm, but regardless, easy fight. Let's uh, keep both these nubs down here. Keep the man down. And we got caffeine pill. I'd rather reroll it. Mm, not great. Not Great that it rolled into a range up. We'll take a little HP and jump down to a uh, basement two. No, nope, looks like cellar two to me. Cellar two it is. Um, I will go in here right away, just because I'm a little impatient. Could have got another guppy item. Instead, just some mean spiders. Not even spiders on our side. The bad ones. I think the good ones make a, a big difference, but it would have been something. A little consolation at least instead we just uh from that room basically we just got a heart of damage but that's okay we could uh we could afford to tank it that's why i went in there in the first place uh my secret room opening plan not going so hot so far but uh i don't have too much control over that if i continue to not get bombs so we'll just hope for it to change going forward uh, I could have maybe on the first floor not used the bomb, um, but I did get the two soul hearts that I have from using that bomb on the curse room, so I can't feel too upset about it. All right, the spiders take two shots. These guys take like four, but we should be fine as long as we uh, predict their movements, keep a, a safe berth. And room is over. We got the boss room. We don't have a reroll ready yet, and I want one because uh, we will be facing our deal with the devil here. So here we have, uh, we can get in the item room first and then go to the boss room. Oh man, that was a risky dodge if I've ever seen one. Okay, cleared that, cleared that issue right out. There we go. There we go. Now I should be fine here and keep my distance. We've cleared like a, a safe corner. We've got ourselves a little sanctuary as I almost get hit again there by getting a little too close, but should be good. There's a bomb in there and a bomb chest. The bomb chest is actually close enough that I think we could blow it up with just a single bomb, but we don't have any. 
We might be able to use a bomb, hit that bomb rock, and blow up the bomb chest. Polyphemus is amazing. Obviously not going to reroll that. Um, our damage has already increased thanks to uh, the sin robes, ceremonial robes. So Polly has a little extra boost along with it. And we'll go fight the boss and see what our devil deal holds. Got enough HP to trade a bit of it away. So we got a pin fight. Pin's minion is already dead. Pin will soak up all of this damage because he's, you know, got a lot of HP. So the polyphemus effect where it like splits into a smaller shot won't really take effect unless... There are minions, but he doesn't really spawn any. It's just the one that starts on the fight. Definitely take Squeezy for a tears up, helping uh, Polly's only drawback. And I'll definitely take both of these and then reroll uh, Guppy's head after we pick it up and use it once. And unfortunately, we're not Guppy, but Headless Baby's a, a decent pickup since we weren't going to take Guppy's head with us. I will check to see if maybe we could find a bomb, see if there is a trap room around here we could use to further our guppy dream um, just check everything out here sure pinky eye is decent no bombs uh, just a single bomb game would would go a long way with me uh, that was that's just not what you want to do on this room I'm very used to walking straight ahead when I enter a room and it's an easy way to take damage there obviously let's kill this one quickly and then we can do some fun stuff here with Polly Yeah, nice. It's so cool. All right, just a little bit of money. I actually am really tempted to look for a bomb in here. Like, is it worth it? Ah, uh, I don't think. Uh, I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. Is there a bomb in here? It's a bomb. I bought it without even hesitating. Um, because I, I believe in this this idea that much. All right, so with proper placement of this bomb. Hopefully, it will definitely uh, give us our bomb just back right away. Oh, almost did it again. Almost did it again. And hopefully, it'll get this... Uh, should give us our bomb back. Okay, well, we're going to have to use two bombs, unfortunately. I thought maybe we would just need the one. Um, but the cancer trinket's pretty awesome. Was that totally worth it? I mean, we basically traded five cents for the kink cancer trinket. Would I do that typically? Yes. So when you when you break it down that way, I think it was worth it. It might not be how everyone would choose to break it down, but I think it, it makes sense when you when you think it out and you reason it out. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Seriously? There we go. I had to get like just an inch a little closer. Don't be a d bag. All right. These guys are very easy with the the poly setup we've got going on here, and just I, I need to be aware in the future that I create a uh, creep because it's very easy for me to get confused as to which creep is mine and which creep is the enemy's, and take some damage. Um, I create creep, but that doesn't mean all red creep is safe. It's important to know that. Nice. Now I don't want to shoot that that poop necessarily right away here. But I do want to shoot these. Uh, one of those is a shop and one of them is a, a library of some sort. So that's a little interesting. Still no bombs. Haven't opened a single secret room so far. Thanks so much for that plan. We do have a reroll ready. And nothing that I feel comfortable using it on. So that's sad. A sad story. Uh, for sale baby shoes never worn. Mmm. No bombs. It's frustrating. It's a little frustrating for me right now. Not to have a single bomb here, but... Game being uh, at least kind with keys, and I appreciate that. Goat hoof. I don't want the goat hoof. Sad bombs, does it give me five bombs? Yes, it does. So that fixes that. Now, I think our secret room might be here, which would be, like, the most amazing location of all time. Indeed it is. Fantastic. And we got more bombs as a result. So I feel totally fine going here first. And that's actually our shop. 
I'm tempted to see if we can get the battery. Don't want red candle. Let's put another bomb here. Sad bombs are just good in general, too. Book of Secrets. Just use it. Pick up the Bible, put it back down. We're probably not going to get up to any reroll silliness in here. Um, Book of Secrets just gave me the compass effect that time. Book of Secrets has uh, the ability to give you any one of the mapping, so it gives you either uh, map, blue map, or compass. Gave us the compass effect there. I think those are the three. I'm pretty sure there aren't any others. Hmm. I mean, we're not going to get another reroll, so I'm just going to keep going here. Mm -mm. Nice. The Headless Baby is actually a great get against these guys. Because they walk towards you in a straight line, just kind of hang out on the creep. Makes them much easier to take out. Bomb's coming fast and furious now. I'm actually just going to keep them... So we're strong enough. I'm not actually going to look for magic mush. I'm going to keep the bombs for now. Uh, maybe I should. Maybe I should take a look to see what pills or uh, if we could find magic mush. I'm rethinking this. Let's go back here. I'm rethinking this because magic mush is so good and we haven't seen our pills yet. So they could be very good as well. So we'll put down a couple bombs where we can get... A cluster of four here. How about that? Speed down. That's fine. I'm still not going to pick up the goat hoof. I feel good, better with uh, cancer. I found pills. And health up. Health up's nice. More uh, devil deal fodder for trading away here. And we got a playing card here, which is a joker card. Fantastic. We'll use that on this floor if we don't get a devil deal later if we do. And... Got pestilence fight. All right, so we won't be able to get the uh, the battery. I won't go back and donate now, though. We're just gonna wait until uh, the next floor shop if we if it is a shop and not a greed fight. Are you dead yet? Yes, you are. And we got a cube of meat. I rerolled the cube of meat because I, I just didn't want it. It's good protection, it's a good orbital, but I just I just was feeling maybe just going for damage. Where We have the benefit of being in a safe run. You know, trying to get some kind of crazy poly damage synergy is a, a fun thing to do. Trying strictly for the win, I would probably never reroll the cube of meat, um, if I'm being honest, but I decided to do it here because I'm... I'm Pretty confident we're going to get the win going forward and just wanted to have some fun. Alright, should be able to take out the TNT barrels here. Took a little bit of damage. Damn spiders always seem to get me. Oh, and I'm an idiot. I was supposed to use the Joker card on the last floor and I, I did not. <laughs> Alright, well we'll keep it. Maybe there'll be another devil deal we won't get. Hopefully I won't end up looking like a damn fool for not using it there. And not get another deal. Uh, also not advisable to be uh, fighting this room with Aria Wizard active, but managed to do it. And it's gone now, so that's good. I'm, uh, I'm still kind of like tap shooting the poly. I can just hold it down, but I kind of prefer a little bit more control sometimes. And, oh, hello. Thank you for blocking that fly. You shouldn't have. I really you shouldn't have. You're a total dick. Alright, good timing on a reroll here. We'll just pick up the wafer. It's damn good, so I'm just going to take it. Should insulate me from all of the stupidest mistakes I tend to make on a run. Wow. Did not anticipate getting hit there. Alright, Polly. And we've got the bombs. Small rock me. Now just a soul heart. I'll take it. And here is our boss fight. Let's see if we get a deal here. Well, what did I say? Clusters of four? 
two pills, we don't know. Two balls of steel pills, that's amazing. And we got a dark one fight. All right, number one rule. There's only one rule for the dark one, and that's don't get below him, as I did right there a couple of times. And even though I haven't gotten hit by his down shooting laser, I got hit twice already on this fight. But should be fine now. It's a symptom of a, it's a symptom of it being uh, the first run of the day and it me being a little lazy with my play because we're strong. I'm not going to take uh, the knife. Um, I am going to take that and become Guppy. And I am going to reroll both of these. And that's kind of what I was hoping for. Take Abaddon. It's pretty damn good. And we should be just cruising now. No sweat for the rest of the run. So I want to look and see where the most viable location is for our secret room. Probably, well, let's go in here. Oh, hello. I wanted to donate, but instead it's you. And you gave me like a pittance of money compared to what you sometimes give. Uh, I think secret room is, m where is it even likely to be? I guess maybe it could be like a, Above here, but we gotta check and see if there's another room up top here first to, to make that call. Yeah. Oh. So that's the most likely place, probably right here. Nice. No item again. Um, I'm gonna stick with uh, cancer. Liberty cap's real good if you're trying to go fast. Um, gives you that mapping, but I'm gonna stick with the damage. Justice is nice. And. Yeah, a couple of chests. I'll open them. A speed down. We've got a couple of consumables and a speed down, so it's not good, but we should be able to wreck this room, hopefully, without taking any damage. Mega Maw can sometimes catch me unawares, but he didn't even get a chance to do any attacks, so. Literally zero chance of me getting hit there, uh, as long as I started firing early enough. And should have a reroll ready quickly on the next floor. I was going to go check and see if I could donate again, but then I remember greed was in the shop. So let's grab the speed up and down we go. Unable to farm up a reroll, but it just would have been, you know, adding insult to injury to the game at this point. So there's a, a fourth guppy item. I probably actually. Now that I think about it, should have just re like tried to reroll that. We could get uh, the pact or something in that room instead, uh, but it, it didn't really occur to me. Um, guppy items are like an instant take normally. Let's see. So, is there anything we really need to be afraid of on this run? No. Is there anything else we can accomplish on this run? Perhaps. Um, to be able to try to get the godhead, I would need to get another devil deal, say no to it, and then get an angel deal and try to reroll into it. It's it's, uh, it's a long shot at this point. Um, I should have said no earlier if I wanted to go that route, but I didn't. We had a good chance to become guppy, and I seized it early. And... Um, as a result of that, we uh, we don't have a uh, angel deals going for us, and have very little chance to find the godhead. It still can show up in like boss rush or something, but um, obviously a long shot. Change speed down into speed down. Thank God. Nice, nice, nice. Thank you, flies. This has got to be the way to our boss, I think. Yeah. Any rock tintos in here? Nope. So our boss is Monstro 2, who is already halfway dead. Our flies are very strong, thanks to our poly tears. And didn't get to do much attacking at all. And we get growth hormones. I see, like, I don't think this counts as taking a deal with the devil, so... We'll do this. Um, I'll pick that up. I don't know if that counts as taking a deal with the devil there or not. 
it may it may not i don't really remember with red chest it's weird i know i think it doesn't count because it's not actually an item pedestal but then when an item comes out of the chest does that change it i'm not sure It'll be an interesting thing to find out that's for sure lemon party nice at least we got rid of the the speed down doesn't need to be cluttering up my vision anymore and thank you based flies more keys is nice because we do now have uh, guppy's tail more damage is always nice as well um do i play you i mean i can play you i guess it's I don't know what you could give me that I really want. The compass, maybe. Things like that. Let's reroll that. Oh, goodness. So strong, this run. All right, let's donate just everything. Oh, but hive mind, so good. Oh, well, now I can take hive mind. Uh, Guilt-free, because we, ran out, of mu or we uh, ran out of the ability to donate. Donation machine borked very quickly there. Unfortunately, not able to rack anything up here. And there's the compass that I asked for. So crazy, this run. Oh, man. Oh, uh, so crazy. What else can we get? Credit card, okay. Something. Uh, our spider, or our flies are just going to be insane. Uh, our shots are already crazy, but the, the flies are just going to wreck anything that they touch. Except for the zombies when they run into the front of their face, because they don't do any damage. So, bad example immediately there, but you get the idea. Bombs are key, sure, that gives us more keys. Uh, I do want to look for the secret room. There's a tinted rock over here. Troll bomb and a soul heart that I can't take because I'm at the cap, but I figured why not look for small rock. Um, where the hell is my secret room? Is it like above here like between these two that'd be weird or between these two uh shouldn't use the second bomb there um i'm just gonna blow you up as well for absolutely nothing so that was just a waste of three bombs uh would have been at least two probably no matter what there but three is annoying and we will exit the floor here not really gonna look for a second secret room or anything like that we got the credit card, so if we do get another deal with the devil and want to take it, we can take everything for free. Alright, so we got curse room up top, which I will go to for the, the fun of it. Because we can, basically. And get another soul heart that I can't take. Holy mantle, thank you. Yeah, I figured I'd just tap him once there, see if he was like will, really feeling feeling generous and willing to pay out right away. Um, but yeah, this is, this is obviously an extremely easy, um, run. We're, we're not gonna have any trouble winning here. Curse of the Maze jumped me way forward there, weirded me out. Um, I don't really want Maggie's bow. And we can't donate any more. No bombs. Um, I think we just, we re-roll Maggie's bow. No, I'm gonna reroll the four items on the the. Well, we don't have boss rush, so I will reroll Maggie's bow. I was thinking I was on time for boss rush because this run feels fast, but it's not as fast as I thought. So we roll this first, and we'll just move along. Let's uh, see if we get a deal here. Very easy run. Thank you, Holy Mantle. No deal to be found here, so we're down to the next floor. And Compass showing me the way, which is a long path. Damn. Uh, I'm not interested in the, the dice room. I'm not going to reroll this whole run. That would be crazy. This run is awesome. The huge spiders and flies, Polly, etc. Apologies if you hear a meowing cat in the background. She does that at this time of day for some reason. So 
So around to the left and down. Nope. Or it's going to be all the way up here to the right and down, apparently. Not opening chests because I want the guppies' tail uses on... Wow. On uh, the last... On the, uh, the chest. On the last floor. Oh my god. Holy mantle saving me now and then. Uh, I want I want to be able to use the keys on the chest to open the chest that we get from Guppy's tail. There we go. Figuring out words and things, you know. Yeah, this should be uh, an easy win. We're going to be at a uh, baker's dozen, 13 wins. Uh, this is Womb XL, so sadly uh, our angel devil deal game has run its course. I uh, got a big room, which is probably Mr. Fred, if I had to guess. And then a regular boss room here for the It Lives fight. Oh, no, it's the ca it's a double cage fight. Interesting. Easy double cage fight. Easiest of all time. Uh, we got the matchbook, which we'll reroll because I don't want it. And we'll take the tears and shot speed. And... Now we should be able to produce a whole bunch of flies here. Get in there, flies. Do your thing, baby. Yeah. And we're up to the cathedral. Here's the thing. We got the credit card, and I could maybe get a joker card in this floor to find a deal with the devil, but uh, I wouldn't be able to use both. So I'd use the... Like, I'd pick up the joker card. It would replace the credit card, and then uh, I wouldn't have the credit card when I got into the deal with the devil so not gonna be able to make any use almost definitely of this credit card here unless we you know something insane happens where we find the deck of cards on the chest and it has or we find starter deck on the chest and it gives us a joker card so that we have both cards obviously very niche scenario there but i want to put it out there now so that if it does happen i look like a, a goddamn genius Look like freaking uh, beautiful mind type stuff there. And perfect reroll timing, however. So, on the chest we have... Alright, we got BBF, Poison Touch, Magnet, and the D4. I don't want any of these. Let's reroll them all. Take Sad Onion that's going to up our tier rate a little bit. I'll take, uh, I'll take common cold. Um, that's all I really want out of those. So let's farm up another reroll here. See how crazy we can get. Magic mush is amazing. I'll even take the bombs because we'll prioritize our reroll to the other room there. Um, excuse me, I already took you. House curse plus five poison bombs again. Leave Loki's horns because I don't care about it. Empress card. Interesting. Take that for now. Wow. Just wrecking everything here. That could be decent too. I'm, I'm tempted to... We'll use the sad bombs here occasionally because I want to see what they're like. Yeah, I didn't even... That didn't even get a chance to hit. Let's try in here. How about this? How about this, peep? How do you feel about this? Could hit tier so I could produce some flies here. There we go. Okay. Got hit once on that room, but Holy Mantle saved me. Mysterious Liquid. I'll leave that for now. We might pick it up, though. Reroll here. Um, yeah, I gotta do it. We're gonna have maybe like a slow charge time, but I gotta try it. We'll pick this up, too, because it'll give us a tears up, even though it gives us a knockback. Uh, it's not the slowest of the charge times but it's pretty slow we're just going to produce so many damn flies that nothing's going to stand a chance let's bomb for a secret room here maybe no could be either of these places no huh all right Yeah, everything that doesn't die from our initial barrage is going to die from, like, three or four flies, and you're done. You're done, son. Uh, 
Oh, hello. Thank you, Holy Mantle. Just full clearing here because uh, it's a fast run and I'm enjoying it. Uh, we're very powerful and it's very relaxed. And good uh, win number 13. Never really posed a threat. I'll take the speed and shot speed. So... Want that. I think we're just going to end up picking this up because we've got other reroll targets. Doesn't really matter which one. Take the halo for more damage. Not a ton, but it does give us more damage. Got Lazarus Rags down there to reroll as well. Just trying to produce as many flies as possible. Uh, it's kind of hard to get my tears to hit instead of the flies. Here we go. Okay. Oh, yep. See? Like, I can't even... Can't even get a shot in before the tears just wreck. And we should actually get another reroll even. No problem. Thank you, flies. A little bit of money. Wow. Yeah, when you kill those tanky enemies that fast, that's pretty huge. We'll just take Demon Baby with us and, and go ahead. I think that's, that's going to be it right there. Sadly, a lot of our flies died right there, so we won't have as many into the fight. But we'll take Mom's Bra. And let's Empress, Mom's Bra. And yeah, we really needed that. Oh, man. Well, that's win number 13. Looking good with a bra on my head. If you like the video, leave a like or a comment. We're going to be doing an Eden run next time. If you want to see more Isaac videos when they come out, please subscribe. I'm Accidental Grenade. Thank you so much for watching.